Hey ladies, it's Ebony and I'm coming at you with another beauty video, um, another hair video. And uh, this one is gonna be about a twist out. So obviously this this ain't it right here. But, uh, but yeah, so I'm gonna be just kinda showing you guys how I do my twist out. So this is what works for me and uh, hopefully you all can glean something from it. <laughs> Okay, so now my hair is all detangled. The next thing that I'm gonna end up doing, you have either two, one of two options. So you can either do some air drying, then option number two, which is the one that I'm gonna do, is blow drying. And uh, fortunately enough, I have a blow dryer that allows me to have a cooler setting. So that's what I'm gonna use. All right, so my hair is all blow dried. So now here is the big secret, the big thing that makes sure that my curls are defined and helps them to stay. Um, yeah, this is my, my biggest secret. So after all this, even though I have just pretty much dried my hair, I'm gonna use a spray bottle of water and dun da da da, Elastic QP, hopefully you guys can see that. It's the Elastic QP um, Design Silk Thermal Styling Spray. So I use this along with some water to dampen my hair and um, and then this helps me to, to keep the hold all day so my curls, a little twist out isn't looking all like a flat out <laughs> by the end of the day, just a flat and frizzy and crazy. So that is all set and then now we will go on to the actual twist up. So the first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and do like a zigzag part. Hopefully you guys can. So I'm just doing a zigzag part down the, um, the back of my head. And the reason I do that is because it makes it easier to blend it the next day. Because I generally will end up sleeping in this. So. I'm going to clip this side up and away. Okay, so that side's all set. So now I'm just going to go ahead and do a flat twist on this side. So I'll just comb through it with my fingers, and then I'm just going to start with about... I'm trying to scoot in here a little bit, so hopefully you can see that. I'm going to start with about a section that's maybe like one inch this way, and then about two inches back. So I'll go ahead and I'm going to twist that. So I just take it and twist it twice. That gives me a good anchor. So now I'm just going to grab some of this hair. I go all the way back to my uh, part that's in the back there, grab a section of hair and pull that in and blend it with that section that I just had. So I just pulled it in and I grabbed it with this hand. Then I do the same. I pull that smaller section over go in, part it, and pull that over. And I keep some tension on it so that it all ends up pretty flat at the end. And then I just twist all the way down to the ends. Then on the end, I just take a roller, like a really, really small roller. And I'm just gonna use that, just what you can't see. I'm just gonna wrap the hair around it twice and then I just roll up so that it covers itself. And then this one I'm actually going to clip right up front. And it looks, it's gonna look crazy for a second, but um, I'm just clipping it there so that I can do the other side.
Okay. So there we have it. So that one is finished. So now what I do at night is go ahead and I take this one and I'm going to bring it back around. So I'll show you guys. Make sure that it's twisted. I'm going to bring it back and around right next to where this braid is. And then I'm just going to take a bobby pin and stick it right in there so it stays. take this one out okay twist it around bring it underneath that one make sure it's nice and twisted try not to pull the roller off and then I'll bobby pin this one up and you just kind of sit back and behind there like so all right, so I'll generally sleep in that, sleep with that overnight. So it's cool, like during the day, I can still kind of run around this way until like if I have something going on at evening, then I can take it out whenever I am ready for the curls. Uh, but until then, I can keep it pulled up, whether it's exercising or whatever. All right, so on to the last step. So I just used an old toothbrush and just smoothed my edges with the Eco Styler gel. And again, this even by itself, super cute hairstyle, like great for spring, summer, which is on its way. So, um, all right, the next thing, I'm just gonna use a microfiber scarf. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this and just fold it into kind of a skinny band like this. And I want it to be as skinny as I can get it so that it doesn't push all of my hair back. So when I take out my twist out, it's like my hair is not pushed all the way back. So we'll go ahead and do that. All right. So there we have that. So that's actually, I'm just gonna push that back just a tiny bit. So it gives it just a shove so it all lays down kind of flat along my edges. So that's all set. And then um, whenever I go to bed, then to protect the rest of my hair, um, of course I have a satin pillowcase. But I have this lovely satin bonnet that um, is not the most <laughs> attractive thing in the world, but I go ahead and put that over so that keeps my rollers from getting caught on anything um, and then I can just put that around the rest of the hair and we're set so that's what I do for the twist out I'll sleep in this um, by the time I wake up obviously everything's going to be dry the gel around the edges is going to be dry I leave this on though while I'm showering so that um, it still stays smooth after my shower and then I just make sure that like the corners are all tucked in like everything and this is pretty much how I sleep so uh, I will be back with the rest of this video tomorrow morning uh, to show you guys how this twist out how I bring take down my twist out and um, how it turns out all right so I'll be back tomorrow morning see you in a little bit all right ladies so it is time for the big reveal So I just take coconut oil and um, I'm using the Spectrum Organic Coconut Oil. Hopefully you guys can see that. So I use about that much. My hair is pretty thick so it's okay. You might have to use more or less. And then I'll take down my little twist. you ladies and if you have any questions at all please feel free to comment down below make sure you like and subscribe this video if you want to see more of them you can also check me out on my blog at beautyisvain.com so I will see you in the next video ladies again if you have any questions let me know and um, until then God bless you and um, have a happy hair journey I'll talk to you soon